John Hansen here with Star Labs, and we're taking a look at the Wilson U648, a keyboard conceptualized by Irv Wilson, the godfather of modern microtonal music, and designed and built by Star Labs. Uh, we're taking a look at a specific kind of layout here today, which um, is very fun for developing new musical ideas. The way it works is um, you got a couple of different directions of intervals. So if this this key here with my red sticker on it is my middle C. In this direction I've got fifths. In this direction I have major thirds. And in this direction I have minor thirds. So you can build simple little triads with these tight little clusters, and you can keep your fingers in, in, in this position here and create the same chord in different roots. And then, and then so, so if this is my major, all I have to do is shift, and I've got my minor of the same root. That's my C major, my C minor. And I can move that little shape around. Very handy for developing new uh, chord progression ideas and it makes it a lot easier to grab very familiar chords as opposed to spacing them out like so on a piano and getting your seventh in there. Awful, awful hand cramps. Very fun to play. Check it out. So inside the perimeter here, we've got the, the mapping that I just spoke about. Little chord cluster, triad, triad clusters. Outside of this perimeter, we can start paying attention to the regular piano color coding again. We've got our major scale here, like just on, on a piano. Um, and then, you know, our black keys are our sharps and flats, so in this way, we, direction, we have a chromatic run. In this direction, we also have a chromatic run, sharps and flats. Then this way, we have a whole tone scale, which will run directly into an augmented arpeggio in the same key. So if I run my finger this way, whole tone, scale, tone, scale, whole tone, scale, same key, augmented arpeggio. Sounds very interesting. Very fun. You can play regular voicings over here that you're used to and then over here you over here we've left this uh, also in the regular piano tuning but you could tune this to uh, chords you could put chords underneath, underneath any of these so you could almost have an accordion layout um, so you could place all your favorite chords under each of these keys It'd be really fun